this is our porch. Very large, it's 10 and a half by 16. And you've got the stained ceiling. This porch is completely maintenance free. Um, it's made of pressure treated timber and then it's encased in a PVC. So there's never any painting needed. Uh, down here we have a lot of people that are painting every year because of the, uh, the weather and we just wanted a maintenance free house. We also have the engineered wood on the floor. So we'll go in through this door. Into the first room. Nice high ceilings. All of the televisions have been hooked up and mounted. All of that stays. And all of the furniture that I'm showing um, is included with the house. Nice high ceilings. We have a lot of custom-made features in this house. The wine rack is one of them. I wanted a place to uh, display my wine glasses. And the backsplash is Carrera marble. It uh, has beveled edges. So it's uh, a little bit different. I didn't want the just the subway tiles. I wanted it to be. Um, I just really love this look. The corner cabinets. I removed the wooden shelves and put had glass shelves made um, so the light will shine down through. And there's a plug-in in that cabinet. I have plug-ins, a lot of plug-ins. <laughs> there's a dishwasher. So this is the room that could... This is a very flexible floor plan. This could be a dining room. This can just be a TV room. I had my couch and all of my living room furniture in here at one time, but I moved things around a lot. <laughs> Stainless steel appliances, large fridge. And again, you just have the really high ceilings. They just give everything a very open feel. I also want to show you this cabinet. And I have my coffee maker and it slides out. You make coffee in the morning. And when you're finished, it just slides back in. Close away so you don't have it on your counter. And the shelves above it, we had uh, designed so that the canned goods will roll to you. So that's a lot of storage. This kitchen actually has a lot of storage. And here in the hallway, I have a full-size washer and dryer. Stacked. And then this is the hallway that leads down to one bedroom and the bathroom. Nice tall cabinets. High ceilings. This bathroom has a walk in shower and lots of storage.
and go into the other room. Lots of closets and storage. We have a queen size bed in here now, but this could be changed out to a king size. And the uh, side tables can come out also. They just slide out so that you could use your own furniture in here if you wanted. Again, high ceilings. All of the heat vents and air conditioning vents are in the ceiling, so you don't have those on the floor. And that's, a, that's really good. Okay, and we're going into the next room. This room could be used as um, a living room or game room or a master bedroom. It could be a very large master uh, with an ensuite. Um, the bathroom is there and then it has closets over on this wall and a bar <laughs> and wine chiller. view from here. These are large windows. They let a lot of light in and um, again all the furnishings and the drapes and everything stays. Very high ceiling, and we have another fan. These cedar doors are not your normal um, sliders. They are very heavy. They're uh, made of um, a wood that has spruce on one side and cedar on the other. So they're very substantial, and when they close, they really give you a lot of soundproofing because they are heavy very heavy duty. And this picture is a navigational map of the area. Uh, and that's from 1984. So we had that frame to go with the rest of the decor in here. Go down this hallway. This leads to the outside in the back. And here's the second bathroom. This has a tub and a shower. And this has a bidet also. Uh, we had um, this remote control. So we had the electricity and the water and all set up for that. And again, we have double doors from this room that lead out onto the porch.